The theme for my life is misplacing everything and refusing to turn the big light on even though it would help me find things faster. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Doesn't matter if the snow is falling or the wind blows in the rain is pouring. It will always be Christmas in the I truly did have so much fun in New York, but there is just something about being in my house and hanging out with you that hits different. I really just need to have a incredibly, or an incredibly, grammar police. I need to have an incredibly slow day today. It's Sunday. Not a lot has to happen on Sundays. There is plenty to do around here to keep me busy, to keep my mind stimulated. I've told you guys this before, but the day after I get back from traveling, for some reason, I always have a super down day. I'm never productive. Although I did sleep in a little bit later than I normally normally would. I think I slept till like 9.30. During Vlogmas, I get up at 6, 5.30 every day to edit. That was a really hard routine to keep in New York because we were out doing things until super late and then I was tired. In the beginning, I was keeping that schedule and waking up, but then my aura ring was literally alerting me that I need more sleep and that I'm struggling and I could feel it. I could feel that I was struggling, but I really wanted to soak up every moment that we had in New York because we never had been to New York during Christmas before. It was so magical. We probably could have done more, but I think we did plenty. I'm so happy to be home. I hate traveling. Luckily, I had a non-stop flight. I got to the airport hella early, thinking that I would have time to sit and edit my vlog, and none of the outlets were working, so I couldn't charge my computer. And then by the time I landed, it was like 10, 10.30. I had to drive 30 minutes back here, and I'm not gonna lie to you, I was too tired to try and finish that video in an hour. So for the first time in years of doing Vlogmas, I didn't post a video yesterday. It did kill me inside, but now I'm a human being. It happens. There's literally not much I can do about it, so I'm not gonna sit and make myself feel bad. You're still getting the video. I just finished opening some PR. Roll that clip. We're opening packages that came while I was gone. One of the packages is Tamerlan lattes. I made a TikTok of me trying these about a year ago, and they were ass. ASS. Disgusting. They wanted redemption, so they sent these to me. So we're gonna see if they made them better. Now they have oat milk, and they're sweeter. We have mocha and salted caramel. She's foamy. That is so much better. I just don't love the salt. And if that was cold, it would be 10 times better. I was brutally honest with them last time. Can't take my pride. Can't take my humor. Nothing in this world was ever worth keeping. That is so much better. I don't think I love the whole salted caramel vibe, but like if they made a vanilla version of this, I could drink that. It's drinkable. Time for mocha. That was miserable. Oh, okay. Just based on the smell, this has more potential. That is good. I don't know that I taste coffee, but whatever it is, it tastes fabulous. You redeemed yourself. We want vanilla. We want vanilla. We want Say it, Duncan. We want vanilla. We want vanilla. Yeah, get into it. I wasn't expecting that to go well at all. This is something that I saw on TikTok shop. It gets me every time. It's from a brand called Cider. It's a jumpsuit. Future me will tell you if she likes it or not. Right now. I hate cleaning up after this. Shut the front door. You're joking. This is from Clean Skin Club. I'm about to have the best day ever. Christmas is here. These are the face towels I use. Extra large face pads. Never did I ever think I needed an extra large one. <gasps> an antibacterial pillowcase. Vitamin C brightening booster. I didn't know they had skincare. Stem cell plus brightening eye cream. I don't have an eye cream in my regimen at the moment. Pineapple glow mist. Don't mind if I do. Mm -hmm. Sweet dream mango cream. Cleansing facial wipe. They make ass wipes for my face. I'm intrigued. A travel size little box of the face towels. Clean slate acne clearing face and body mist. I'll report back on if that works on my butt cheeks or not. You do you, but do is D. 
DEW, a face wash, clean towels XL bamboo version, regular box of the XL towels, which I'm almost out of. What is this? Clean towels XL Supreme. They wrote Supreme real fucking big on this box. Extra exfoliating, extra absorbent. Acne patches. These are torn open though, is that bad? What are you? A container? <laughs> oh, it comes with more too? I'm never gonna need more face towels. I'm a happy girl. This is in its own little box. A little travel bag. Is it for your towels? Duh. I don't know why this is making me feel so much more adult. I feel like I have my shit together now. Poppy. I've been really into drinking poppies recently. Watermelon. I don't think I've ever had watermelon. Shout out to you, pops. This is from Sleepy Tie. I bought these with my money. When I went to Texas and got my hair done by Devin, she gave me one of these. Now I'm obsessed, but I can't find it anymore. So I had to repurchase my own. It looks like this, which is kind of confusing, but you put your hair in a ponytail on top of your head, like a loose one, put it over it, wrap it around this part, and then you take this and you wrap it around, and you just have a big old ball on top of your head, but make sure it's not too loose or it'll pull on your hair, and you wake up with beautiful hair. It just works. We finally arrived at the final item, a purchase I made myself during Black Friday. Maturing is taking a second to vacuum up the mess before you put the new rug down. It's just a rug donkey. How do you feel about it? Was my vision bad? Is this ugly? Do we love this or do we hate it? I really don't know what to think. But I opened one package before I turned the camera on. And of course, it's the most iconic package. Are you ready? Disney sent me a package. I bought myself two more Stony Clover bags while I was in New York because they had a store and I could get them customized right there. So now when I travel, I have a full set and I shouldn't have to ever buy any more, realistically. They had this in the store and I almost bought it, but I didn't. Because I thought to myself, I would probably only use this when I'm packing to go to Disney. And now I know there was a reason why I didn't buy it because they already sent it to me. They sent me a lot of other goodies too. Like some bath salts, oh, oh. a lip smacker, some lip balm, a bath bomb. They sent Duncan some little ears. They're so cute. Getting a PR package from Disney was just not on my 2023 bucket list, but here we are. Also repping the merch Alicia Marie herself sent to me in 2020. 2020 probably. <coughs> doesn't know what's coming yet. Y'all went hard for Vlogmas in 2020. You really did. I put new sheets on my bed yesterday. I've been trying to find comforters that I love and you guys probably see me have new comforters way too fucking often. I finally found the style of comforter that I wanted. Got this from Pottery Barn Teen to collab with Love Shack Fancy, I believe. Everything about my room is just coming together. She just needs to be cleaned a little bit. I also never opened this this morning. Much better. I need the sun in my life. Look how cute she is now. I was really hoping it would be slightly colder here. If I'm being completely honest, it's still hot. When I got back, it was 80 degrees. But for those of you concerned that I'm not gonna have a white Christmas, I've said it before and I'll say it again. We're going back to Wisconsin for Christmas. You just have to endure the next eight to nine days here in Florida with me. I don't know what day I'm gonna leave exactly, but we're driving. It wouldn't be Vlogmas without one road trip. I need to find glasses wipes. I know I have some in here. Is an alcohol pad the same thing as a glasses wipe? Mm. <gasps> a big ass Sharpie. I need this for PR boxes to scribble out my address and stuff. What else can you use to wash glasses? Back to the cupboard. I'm assuming this will work. I got these glasses in New York. I saw somebody on TikTok have them. Story of my life. We immediately went to the Ray-Ban store to buy them. Yes, she was an impulse buy. Not all impulse buys are bad. It came with a cleaning cloth. You just have to find it. They're blue lights, so I can use them when I'm editing. And they have a camera on it. I'm still trying to figure out how to really incorporate the footage from it into my videos. You'd be surprised how good the footage actually looks. I don't know that they're the cutest things I've ever put on my face. I keep seeing people have different ones, but these these were the only ones that I could find and they're black so they kind of match everything. I'm gonna edit in style. Not that I ever don't have style. Breakfast? Thank you. Joe brought me a smoothie bowl. This is a big spoon. Oh, this looks nice. Wait, you like it? Couldn't decide if it was ugly or not. I wouldn't want it in my household. Where do you think all this stuff is gonna go? I 
Kuntai, but it's nice for this area. Like, I would also get one, but I see the vision, and it's nice. It can go in, like, the hallway in our house or something. This is from Soho Juice Co. You guys already know. This is the only recommendation I ever have when people ask where to come when they go to St. Pete. That and Frescoes. I like Frescoes. What's Frescoes? The restaurant by the pier at the end. By the sailboat. Frescoes, yeah, maybe? Yeah, they're, uh, they're doing a lot for you, buddy. Is that... Poppy? Yes. Okay. Might as well just take it to my house. No, because if that's the holiday flavor, I want it. Well, some of it. I won't even have half of it. Mine! Every time I eat recently, I feel like shit. It's definitely from the medicine. I've recently learned that there are certain foods that will make you feel icky. And I haven't been like paying attention to what I'm eating. I need to hop on a computer and do some research. I'm hoping none of these items are on that list because I haven't looked it up yet. Daryl just brought this up. Oh, this is like a box box. Happy holidays from Poppy. Let's see. I think, I think, I think, I'm not gonna get too excited. I think it's the holiday flavor. Is this a robe? Is this a poppy robe? Do I need another robe? <laughs> yes. I don't care if I look stupid. This is a yes. What else? Oh, a gift for you and a gift for a bestie. Gerald, I have a gift for you. Hey, Gerald, kind sir. Can I give you a present? Are you ignoring me? <sighs> well, I have enough poppy to last a lifetime. I don't know if you guys know. But it's really good. It's the best one. It's really unfortunate that it's just a holiday flavor. Oh, were you not in here that whole time? I have a present for you. It said I'm supposed to give this other one to my best friend. Poppy is hooking us up. No, it's mine. But You're mine. These ones, but you can have the, the these ones that are in these. You can two. have the ones that suck. Oh, the other ones don't suck. The only one I don't like is this one. Let me try again. Ooh, I don't like that one. I'm keeping it real. They have some good ones and they have some that aren't. Personal preference. <sighs> that's nice. Where do you rate the robe? Crazy cat lady. Oh, that's fair, I guess. I was thinking like a Teletubby. That's just degrading and rude to yourself. Why? It's all the Teletubbies. Usually people use those as insults. How? Have you looked at a Teletubby recently? No. Oh, are they like fat? I say somebody looks like a Teletubby and I'm not being nice. Battle of the gingerbreads. Year three. I think I've won all the previous years. I don't think you have. I think if we go back, I think I won. You didn't. All of the years? Yeah, you didn't. Mine last year was so good. But it wasn't better than mine. Maybe in your humble opinion. No, there was, it was, you put it on a video. And people picked you over me? Yeah. That's rude. It's gonna happen again. It's not. First time it was with your mom. That one I definitely won. No, you didn't. I'm pretty you were sure. horrible at it. No, I wasn't. Last year it was fine. Okay, well that just sounds like this year I'm gonna be great. It sounds like you're improving, yeah. Doesn't mean that mine will just regress. I've never seen gingerbread houses that come with little jigsaw puzzle edges. So look, well, actually I don't know what goes where. Piper, if you eat my gingerbread house, we're gonna have a problem. I'm assuming it makes it easier to stick, but we'll see. It smells great. Like I'm wondering if I can go without like a back wall or I could just order graham crackers. Ooh, golden bears. Those do. Those, Those are good. I thought it was supposed to come in the bag. It feels soft, smooth, and consistent. That's not gonna work. Cap goes inside. How is it supposed to stand on that? Did I break this off? You would think I'm like so good at this by now. When this goes like this. Okay, so I need to pipe this side a little bit. Okay, this side a little bit. The inside. First piece to set in the tone. It doesn't even sit straight. This is rigged. Let it go a long way. Oh, shit. <gasps> Look at the difference in how yours is versus mine. Yours holds itself up just like that. Is this important? Oh, it is. I really wanted to eat it. What did they suppose we do with the middle of the roof? Precision. I almost feel like it makes it more slippery when you use this. Yet yeah, here I am. I do feel like you have a slight advantage. That's just an observation. What did you look at it like that for? Mine doesn't stick together like yours does. And mine is not weatherproof on the top. This piece, you go like that. So then both sides of the chimney have a pattern. You knew that you had the better one. How did I know that? Do I automatically get like five points ahead? No, that is horrible though. What is horrible? Why don't they touch? I don't know, that's not my fault. That's fine, I'll just make up for it with decoration. No balls left behind. Not on my watch. It's always the green balls that run away. Grinchy green balls.
These are our final houses. Mine on the right, Gerald's on the left. It's now your turn to pick whose is better. Keep in mind, I've never won apparently. Please pick me. I used to film whole videos on this. That's just so zoomed in. I requested sushi for dinner, lunch slash dinner. I was priding myself for liking sushi now, but then I have to humble myself and remind myself that I only get California rolls with no avocado. <laughs> Who's ready for their outfit? I think Piper's ready. Piper, sit. Good girl. Huh? You love your sweater. Oh, who is the cutest? Oh, you love your sweater. Paw, good job. Good job. Now you both get sweaters. Are you loving the sweater? Oh, I see your tail wagon. Don't act like you don't like it. And you're so pretty. Ho, ho, holy shit, what a year. And yours is just a Christmas sweater. That takes so long to fill up. I have some bad news coming. Every single time I see my mom, <coughs> I end up getting sick and I was hoping that this time would be the exception. I don't know if you know this, but Mama Kelly for the past two and a half years has had a cold that will not go away. They have thought they figured out what it was like 9,000 times and it never ends up being right. Ugh. In theory, it wouldn't be something that I could catch and I seem to be the only person who gets sick around her Which I don't know if that should be a red flag as in I'm gonna have her health issues at the beginning of the day I kind of let out a couple of the <clears throat> And now my chest is on fire. So we're gonna see what kind of medicine that we have. We have the basic NyQuil, DayQuil. I also have this, but I'm pretty sure most of what's in here is expired. Alrighty. Theraflu, would this be gross? Cold Ease, clinically tested to shorten colds by 42%. Sounds nice. Laxatives, vitamin D. I could use vitamin D. Vaporub, okay, I'm prepared. Flonase, oh. 97.7 Making sure I'm drinking a lot of water. I'm probably not supposed to mix all of these. I say let's shoot some Flonase up our nose. Let me just practice. Oh, okay, there she goes. These are gonna be our besties tonight. Let's test out our tea kettle. That should be good. Tea kettle in action. Never made this before. Direction. I think I just add this to the hot water and I stir. Seems like something I can't even mess up. Where did I put those? The theme for my life is misplacing everything and refusing to turn the big light on even though it would help me find things faster. I found one. These are the emergency crystals. I don't know why, but I cannot stand regular emergency. Tastes like shit. And these little crystals taste like candy. But my only advice is don't take the whole thing at once because it's actually kind of sour and overwhelming. I take it in thirds. They're like pop rocks. I don't know why. Step one, take emergency, finished. My kettle doesn't whistle, so how will I know when the water is ready? I feel like testing it with my finger is not the smartest idea. Okay, it's not that hot. Ugh. This takes so much longer than I thought. At least it's a cute kettle. I feel like I hear something going on. Oh yeah, she's hot. Well, that was effective. That's sweet. Not what I was expecting. Oops. I'll put it in up top. I made a little bit of a mess. We need it to get steamy. I don't love that, but it's drinkable. And the warmth feels really good on my throat. I'm 25 and I'm terrified to try new things. Usually I would just stick to my NyQuil and my DayQuil, but I gotta start branching out. I put my sleepy tie in, even though I'm washing my hair in the morning. I'm supposed to drink this within 10 minutes. For some reason, the second you put a time limit on something, it's impossible to me. I'm gonna pretend it's hot chocolate. 
I should not be up this late. Do you think that's where you get to lay? The last thing I want to do is skincare. But I've been doing my best to stick to a routine. Routines save lives. <laughs> Ugh, Thera flew burp. Is that glass? Why is there glass in my finger? If your cats need stimulation, get them one of these. If I want peace, I have to take it away. He loves it. I haven't even unpacked my skincare yet. So I'm just gonna use what's left in my bathroom. One armpit, two armpit. Let's try some of the stuff we got. Ooh, okay. Green eye cream. Eye cream's probably the one area I'm slacking. I always forget eye cream, but not today. I guess we'll do the trifecta and test out their moisturizer as well. That's a lot. I always use the extra on my hands. No complaints so far. Clean Skin Club, they have more than just towels. Now you know, I didn't know either. Let's do it. I almost just brushed my teeth with cortisone cream. That would have been it for me. I would have given up. One moment. Or a ring must go back on. Look at my children. Y'all have taken so many naps today and you couldn't be more on my pillows. It's bedtime, guys. Can you please move? Down here looks really nice. Yeah, you should sleep down here. Okay, good job. Dunky. That's where mommy's gonna sleep. You can sleep anywhere else on the whole entire bed. I forgot my water bottle. And Gerald's not here to get it for me. It's a nightmare. Getting up to get the water bottle is not a girl's job. You guys know the drill. No phones before bed. That's my foot, Dobby. I'm gonna read my Kindle and hope my cat doesn't eat my foot. I've got NyQuil if I need it, but I'm gonna try not to have to take it. And I've got coldies. I really hope I don't wake up tomorrow sick. Because if I do, I hope you're ready to do a whole lot of nothing. I love you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me. I don't even remember what we did. I stopped paying attention the second I got a tickle in my throat. Comment down below if you're also sick. And also comment down below any remedies that I can try tomorrow to try and make this cold or whatever it is not last as long. Thank you. Like, is there something I can make in my crock pot that would make it go away? I'm also just in the crock pot mood. I want to use my crock pot. Maybe also comment crock pot recipes. I was supposed to be in bed two hours ago, so. I love you. I'll see your pretty faces tomorrow. See you later. I'm trying to come up with a rhyme and it's not working. So I guess you're just gonna have to settle for goodbye. Nighty night.